Welcome to Earthworm Gym 2 for the Sega Saturn. I say the quality on this game looks great. Keep on playing the same music over and over again. Not all that interested. It's like, what the heck? And she got catch it. It's like, oh man, not again. Screaming pink. Probably the same. only company that did this game. Press start button. I gotta say the quality of this game looks pretty darn cool. You'll get to see like a couple of minutes of this gameplay. Oh, oh. this looks so cool. For a wacky sequel. Better than the first game. Option. Yeah, it's controller. Normal, hard, easy. Normal. Which is medium. Wow, look at that loading screen. Anything but tangerines. <laughs> this is gonna be good. Yeah, shoot everything. Tinder, <laughs> Tinder. Tim Tim go, Jim, go. Go, Jimmy, go. Swing across and then you do just no ha ha. This music sounds so much better than uh, Sega Genesis and Super Nintendo. Nintendo. Oh, but on the mid 90s of this game, uh, had that rocking guitar. Speaking of it, you got about the catchphrase. Wow. Yeah, rock and roll. Oh, Jimmy. All my favorite sequel games out there. This one's most likely in the one. The only one I enjoy is this game. Especially its cartoon style. Look like they put time and effort into this background for this game. Looks great. Press down. Yeah. Grab the piggy. My doggles. Adams. There's the piggy here, and... Take that, Bob. Freaking bubbles. Too bad they're useless. Luckily, this level is pretty short, and so is the music. Well, the power's weapon is powerful enough. And I like the work continue with random crazy colors. Gotta take out the octopuses. That blast their guns. This is the coolest sequel they ever did. I mean, who doesn't want to play an Earthworm Gym game from the 90s? I'm pretty sure they're going to do the animated show as well, which I'm pretty sure is coming. They won't say, but it looks like it could be interesting. So yeah, you stupid cat. Now there's tons of bomb to kill with goldfish. I am enjoying this soundtrack. Incoming come in old ladies. Don't let them hit you. If they hit you, you have to go all the way at the bottom and you have to do it all again. Quit it! I like how the sequel gives you like different weapons. Like blast or weapon that blow very heavy on the screen. Assault only signal one. 
Gotta get used to seeing that loading screen. Granny chair. Yeah, we all know what that means. Well, I'll probably make the music sound more... more quite ironically perfect. Sounds very... terrific to hear. Get back to life, but I don't want to get hit by that old lady and go... all the way down and do it all again. Just like how Jim is home the entire world, home of his hand. There's not much else to say about the sequel, but I'm gonna get the same princess what's her name again. It's like last time. You, you just uh, take on a few bad guys and bosses. And that's it. That's all you do in this game for like probably two hours. This game is not too long, but I'm pretty sure you'll probably beat this game like close to an hour and 30 minutes. As long as you don't die, or keep screwing up like I am right now. I like how they make them really cartoony in this game right here. Makes them pretty... That's what he is right now. Based off the cartoon show of her from Jam from the 90s. I swear Steven Spielberg did it. It's kind of a shame that the show didn't last long. And that's a for like two seasons. And that's pretty much it. Just have her from Jim go out and her with this psychic Pierre Puppy, which I know he's in this game. In the uncalled puppy love that most people despise. Yeah, I know the snot. He's actually useful. Yeah. Also, first appeared in the first ever Open Gym from 1994. It was a platform to take on between Slutty Parks and. Well, uh, between something. of a butt. At least the first boss in this game is super easy. First you have to stack up the pigs. Um, make them wait it. Move that heavy thing out of the way. Just gotta avoid the fish bowl there. You'll find some hidden goodies in this game too. This makes it interesting. Sometimes you'll reach out, sometimes you won't. But that's the reason why this is one of the most glorious, fantastic sequels of all time. Playing Earth and Jim in the second game. And doing more combat, our friends. <laughs> And running getting up the cows. I'll say in a pit in my slime. This one. Well done. <laughs> okay, see you guys. Peace tomorrow. And the password.